for an important message from the Prime Minister. We are now beginning to turn the tide, raising awareness of neurofibromatosis, making sure that we spot the early signs. I want to share all of our community's work, their thinking, my thinking, with you, the British people. Latest counts show that 26,500 people alone are affected by NF in the UK. We need parents, nurses and doctors to stay alert for spots with a cafe au lait type appearance. Flat, brown and smooth edged. You may find six or more of them on the skin. These are some of the first signs of neurofibromatosis type 1. As soon as you spot these, refer your child to a GP. Early diagnosis with young children helps with many associated conditions, medical, learning or behavioural. We need to keep raising awareness of neurofibromatosis. Neurofibromatosis type 2 is quite different. It presents much later, usually in teens. If your hearing becomes impaired, get to a doctor fast. Shining a light on neurofibromatosis is not the complete answer. It's only part of the effort towards defeating this disease. We have to get it right. Our community needs to be in the centre and not in the periphery. Neurofibromatosis should not have to be a life in lockdown. With the right knowledge, we can build a roadmap for those that are affected. Each day of raising awareness brings new hope and therefore I urge you at this moment to support Nerve Tumors UK in the current situation of uncertainty in order to continue their services to the community. Let's get raising awareness done.